don't like a motor. You know, you see that car come round there then, you see them just come away from it a little bit. Dead right in front. See the old look. That's a little bit concerning. You know, just how much traffic has he seen? See this look. You know, whatever. I know I've been to Holland, I've driven in Holland, there's plenty of red marks on the road, there's more out there than there is over here, is that? You see, you don't want this van looking, you see? saying this because I told you, you know, or advised you not to buy all your money. But this is your problem. See him now that you don't want this traffic. Alright, well, let's see how he is. He's bouncing on the pole. I've got to give him a touch of the rain just to let him know I'm here. I'm not crabbing your horse. You decide to go and do it. It's your choice. What I'm saying is I wouldn't want to trust him under the right circumstances. Well, you can see for yourself, that's what we're filming it. We've only just left home. Walk. But you know, on all my films on them horses, I broke the very first pair you had. Like, you drive them within a, you know, a, two inches of a bloody motor car, you know what I mean? But I wouldn't say he's trustworthy. He's alright, he's quiet and sensible walk. Within what he knows, we're obviously supposed to be broken doing his job. He's like the British Driving Society, quick clock up the road, do two miles, come round back, steady down, there's a motor car coming. Well, you can't do that when you're doing weddings. You've got to get on and do the job you should care for. Well, I don't want this water here, look, see? Look, see this? My horse having to pull him through. No good, this horse ain't broke properly. It's only a f***ing puddle, isn't it? How would you like that on a wing? Keep bouncing it the road, you see, when the motor comes, he, you know, he clears it. It's right resting on the pole. You don't want to be seen when you're out driving all. Keep having to tap him up with a whip. Don't look right, people don't like it. all the way round here, Rowley Z must be a foot in front of this other horse. Yeah, that horse has got a longer neck than Rowley for a start. Rowley's real short cut around the neck. Rosie's Tracy's flat today, teaching this horse to pull. But this horse should have known this long before he come. Now if you say to me, well he's Dutch and maybe he don't understand you, understands when there's weight on his collar. You know, if he spoke Chinese you'd understand that. You now what I'm saying, it ain't nothing to do with putting horse in a cart. That ain't breaking horses. It's the training of them 
to get them to just respond on your voice, do what you want them to do, and like, when you ask him to work, he don't, he don't want to work, he's lazy, or he's been allowed to be lazy. Now, you say to me, well, does that matter? It matters when you get on ill, and he don't want to work, and leaves it to the other one, and the other one's pulling his guts out, if he's got anything about him, and ends up on his knees, that'd be lovely, wouldn't it? You know, arrive at a wedding he's bleeding. If you've got one old pulling like mad because he won't do his work, yeah, and he therefore, you know, the horse that's working misses his, misses a beat and drops on his knees, yeah, and you turn up to the thing and you've got blood running you've out, got blood running dripping up his knees, it's not a good advert, is it? And say to me, well, would that, yes, I am exaggerating, I'm, I'm looking on the worst way, right? I'm not like other people that look, oh, well, he'll be all right, and he'll be all right. He'll be all right till it goes wrong. That's why you can't a horses in harness. People say, oh, no, you should never do that. What do they know? You can't a horses in harness. The reason being, if you never can't them in harness, right? If you never do that, oh, right, boy, good luck. If you never do that, can't them in harness, if they get a bit upset and they start to canter, then they start running. You know, because they've never been there. You say to me, yeah, but I mean, he'll come. Yes, he will. Definitely, I've never had a horse that didn't. But this training should have been done when he was younger. Right. Get up. Go on. Get up. Go on. 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 Go on.